In April of 2018, the Commonwealth, acting through the Department of General Services, entered into a $201 million Certificate of Participation Financing Agreement with Municipal Real Estate Funding, LLC. The transaction has been referred to during the budget hearings as the Farm Show Lease. Now, the financing agreement, which was entered into without the review of the Board of Public Grounds and Building, obligates Pennsylvania to pay approximately $13.3 million annually, which works out to about $370 million over 27 years for a $200 million uh, refinance your lease. So I have several questions. Um, number one, Mr. Treasurer, should have this transaction been reviewed by the Board of Public Grounds and Buildings since it involves premises owned by the real estate owned by the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania? Uh, it was my expectation that it would have been. Um, the can, you, it, it went, can, you, went, can you tell went, us why it wasn't? When it was, uh, when it was proposed as a, as a lease arrangement, it was my expectation that it would have come before the Board of Public Grounds and Buildings on which I sit. It has not. Um, the justification for that is that it is akin uh, to several other historical trends. And let me be clear. Uh, the justification for this that the, that the, the Budget Office and, and their council has is that it's akin to several other financial transactions that aren't leases. Um, I, can't, uh, I can't opine on something I don't see. Uh, as a lease. Um, I, I would have expected, it was universally described as a lease, I would have expected for it to come that way, but I also will tell you that the, you know, I, I can't comment on the, uh, I, I Great. urge well, you to direct you know, your questions to them. Let me ask you some questions you might be able to comment on then. Uh, the interest rate for the bond was 5%. Um, at the time, the 30-year Treasury rate was about 3%. Do you have an explanation of why the interest rate was so high? I, I don't represent it, I don't, and I urge you, the, I mean, I, I can't comment on a transaction that we had no role in. Do you know if, if the transaction was bid out to, to other banks or other lenders or other uh, bond issuers? I, I, can't, I can't comment on something we, didn't, we weren't in charge of. Do you think the million dollars paid uh, as a fee to, the, uh, to arrange the financing was a reasonable fee? I, I, I will say what I said about other borrowing to fill short-term needs. I think uh, all of this, you know, all of those expenses seem troubling to me. I understand there was, you know, universal uh, determination uh, around certain constraints with the, with the budget, uh, but I don't, I don't particularly like any of these arrangements. How, how about the $325,000 paid to bond councils and other attorneys? Does that seem reasonable in a... I, I, again, I'm not going to comment on something that we're not responsible for. So you, you share our concerns that this, this should have been bid out? Would it, would it normally have been bid out? That this was, it was referred to as a lease. We were told it was a lease, but it wasn't a lease. And uh, as we talked about, your, grand, your grandchild and our children are going to be paying this for 27 years to fill what may have been a one-time one -time hole. So I, I share, I think there was a, you know, a, a regrettable and kind of universal uh, desire to look to more one-time things than more structural things. Uh, I, would, I think it's appropriate for you to examine the transaction. Um, when it was first you know, described as a uh, you know, potential lease, there are ways in which a lease of a facility makes a certain amount of sense and can result in operating improvements. But it did, it did not come before us. There's, uh, there are my understanding, precedent for similar financial transactions that haven't. I think it's an appropriate subject for all of your inquiry uh, and for a conversation with the administration. All right, we appreciate it. And we hope you'll work with us to make sure that uh, we're watching out and protecting the, the assets of the, the Commonwealth from, and the taxpayers and future taxpayers who will have to be paying for this. So thank you. We appreciate it.